Loading dragons, excuse me? Intrigued, intrigued. Um, I also just want to give another shout out. I did it yesterday, I'll mention it again today while we have this open. Um, the person who reached out to me for this game reached out to me at a really weird time where I was very busy, so I didn't get back to them right away. Um, but pretty much they were like, hey, like your content. Uh, if you want to check out Sunhaven, here is a full, you know, code for it. Um, if you want to make content of it, feel free. If you don't, no pressure. Just enjoy it. Have fun. And I'm like, that is the nicest thing. That is so nice of you. So, like, I already have, like, you know, maybe that's the plan. Maybe that's why, I, like, I just have a higher opinion of it already. <laughs> so. One of the best games I've ever played. I love it. Oh, I'm excited now, then. I am excited. Um, but yeah, let's see how we like it. Oh, last games that have controller support. Uh, we gonna, oh, you had half controller support. <laughs> Turn it all the way up. Day, oh, we love games with day speed. Pause during dialogue? I'm going to leave it on unclicked for now. Uh, and you guys are going to have to let me know how that audio is when we actually get in here, okay? There's a multiplayer? I gotta tell Mike. New character. Ooh. Oh, we got like rate. Okay. Okay. I'm cool. Uh, resourceful and ambitious humans have worked up to emerge as one of the most prominent races in the world. Okay, cool. So we have humans, uh, elves, demons, angels, Amari, elemental, and Naga. Okay. Okay. I want to be an elf. I'm going to be an elf. Uh, one of the oldest races in the world and are mystically tuned to the flow of life energy around them. Sorry, I gotta turn down my own audio a bit. Uh, friends to all plants and animals. They are most at home in forests. However, younger members of this race are now spreading out into the world and creating villagers where elves have never been seen before. Okay. Uh, I'm overwhelmed. So that's, okay, that's the race, I see. Body. Make me as pale as can be, thank you. Hair, oh, we love, we love some anime hair. Yes. Yeah, oh. <laughs> you you got me with the anime hair. Uh, you know what? Let's go with that one. I just want to point out that that the, the like the default hair on the section that you choose from uh, looks like Roxas. I got some cute ass eyes. This reminds me of um. Maple story a little bit. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Let's go with those ones. Okay, so here's like, we got some like markings and stuff. That's cool. Let's go with that one. In purple. There's a scroll bar. <gasps> Oh, you're absolutely right. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There is a scroll bar. Oh, how do I get it to go? Okay. I might have to mouse and keyboard this. Oh, oh thank you. I didn't see that. Oh, we got curly hair options. Oh, beautiful. Oh, oh, we love it. We love it. Is there a bald option? Yes. <laughs> Why do I look like Xehanort? Let's go with that one. Let's go with that one. Character creation is your jam. I might use mouse and keyboard for this little bit here, friends, but I, I can't do mouse and keyboard for too long. Oh, so like I have a hoodie. Okay. Got like a little dress. I'm gonna go with the hoodie. I'm gonna go with my like default look, you know? Got boots. Pants? Pants. Got you. Oh, 
Oh my god, we can have like mushrooms coming out of our head. This is cute. I don't want anything though. I'm good. This reminds me of like the wings you could put on your Neopet. This is so cool. <laughs> okay. Okay. Profession farmer. Oh. So these are things you start off with, I'm guessing? Orchard farmer. Rancher. I want a chicken. Or an explorer. Bonus movement speed. Wings. I'm having a weeb moment, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh, that's stuck on screen. There we go. Spellcaster. Duelist. I think I might have to introduce this game to Mike, especially if there's multiplayer here. Toolmaster. Angler, there's fishing. Sorry. Royalty in your last life. <laughs> so you start off with a lot of money. There's a baker. Um, I want a chicken, so we're going to go with this. You forgot to name your character. You're right, I did. I got too excited because there was so much to look at. I am always royalty. <laughs> we can choose to just look after animals. Skip intro. No, no, don't skip. No skipping. All right. I just got two achievements. Create an elf character and customize your character. Two. So I think there's a different achievement for making one of each character, maybe? You would have gone for the royalty. I just wanted a chicken. I just wanted a chicken. <laughs> if I'm very honest with everyone here. Oh, did you crash? Uh-oh. Don't crash. It's okay. It's okay. You can do it. I believe- Oh, no. We got- we got Oh, I like this style. Are you almost done, Mom? I can't be late for the train. Just a moment, Lynn. If you don't take your time, the metal will warp. You know that. I know. I just wouldn't want to miss the train is all. What's wrong, Lynn? Well, nothing. It's just, I don't know if I'm ready to move so far from home yet. Sunhaven is a whole day's ride away. Oh, Lynn. We'll save up extra coin and visit you. Don't worry. You've already put everything into the new home for me at Sunhaven. You didn't even have a cake for your birthday because of me. Don't worry about things like that. Your future is bright. You should be excited for it. Sunhaven is home to Solon, one of the world's greatest blacksmiths. You'll make a fine apprentice to him and you'll learn a lot. Uh, you won't even have time to be worried about home, I'd say. You're gonna meet new people and see new things. Who knows, you might even get married. Married? That's right, this isn't just the chance to grow as a blacksmith, Lynn. You'll do a lot of growing up, too. Sunhaven is a legendary town. There's a reason so many people go there to find what they're looking for. Solon is my boss's name, really? Don't tell me what to do, Mom. I'm royalty. <laughs> now come here, it's done. Renee, hello, how are you doing? I'm so tired, I couldn't sleep last night because I'm excited. Same here. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have a lot of trouble sleeping tonight. Try it on quickly, we have to get going. Grandma's old uh, pauldrons for me. Wider shoulders than you, but I think I made the adjustments properly. The reminders of where you come from and what you're working for. Your grandmother passed them down to me when I began my blacksmith apprenticeship. Now it's time they were passed on to you. They fit perfectly, thank you, mother. I'm gonna really miss everyone, Grandma and Grandpa and all the villagers. We're all gonna miss you too, Lynn, but we're expecting great things from you. Now it's time, we need to get going. All right, let's go. I remember Ski- I remember that username, absolutely! Absolutely, I don't know if you let me know that or not, but either way, welcome on in. Oh my, so many people, I hope there's places for me to sit! Um, I'm sorry, but is the seat taken? Sorry, Lee, these seats are occupied. Oh, sorry to bother you. Ask him when he's gonna finish work tomorrow. It's like, hey, hon, you home yet? You on your way home? <laughs> Hi, hello, I'm sorry to bother, but is the seat taken? 
Tyler, these seats are spoken for. Oh, are you sure? I don't... There doesn't seem to be any... I... Listen, if they say it's spoken for, just move on. Just, you don't want to sit there anyway. It's okay, never mind. Hi, Vincent, how are you? Royalty wouldn't need to worry about an open seat. <laughs> oh, I see us. I guess I could try one more time. Excuse me, but is the seat taken? Sit? You can sit down, I guess. No, not at all. There's room for one more. Oh, really? I mean, that's good. I was worried I wouldn't find a spot. <gasps> Look at the kitty cat on top of the luggage. That's cute. Um, so is that a charm on your belt? People from my village wear charms all the time. What does your charm mean? Ooh, romance, riches, adventure, or peace? Chat, what are we choosing? What are we going for? I don't know if this means anything, but... What do you think? Royalty! Oh. <laughs> Romance, peace, royalty, and riches. <laughs> I mean, adventure. Um. Listen, chat, we need love. This is true. I want to see, I want to see all the cuties in this game. I'm very tempted by riches, though. I have to, I have to admit. Oh, we got a romance keepsake. Romance, like getting married. Well, it's a very pretty charm. If you don't mind me asking, are you heading to Sunhaven? Um, how did you know? So you are heading there too. So if that's where you're headed, this will make us neighbors. I'd be neighbors with you any day. What does this mean? <laughs> Stop flirting. He's kicking his little feet. So it's very cute. Um, uh, what's right? I've actually just left my village for the first time. I'm a little nervous, but I think I'll be okay. By the way, my name is Lynn. What's yours? Crystal, that's a very unique name. <gasps> Did I tell you guys? I started an Animal Crossing save file on the GameCube recently, but I had to restart it at the very, very beginning because I didn't realize I had accidentally somehow put a space before the C in my name. So it was Space Crystal, and I'm like, that's, that's gonna bug me too much not to restart. <laughs> so... Oh my, you're from the great city! How exciting! I come from a village in the eastern region. It's a lot smaller than Sunhaven. I wonder if you've heard the rumors. It said that monster folk have been spotted in recent times around Sunhaven. That deep in the forest, there's a city of darkness where all sorts of monster folk live. Well, that's the rumor, but I'm sure it's only rumor. Sunhaven must be a safe place, don't you think? After all, they have their uh, very own guardian dragon protecting it, and he must be pretty powerful. We're getting like Rune Factory vibes with Rune Factory 4 and Venti. Oh, it sure got dark quite suddenly, didn't it? I can hardly see a thing. I can't see a thing. What happened to the light? Everyone panic. <laughs> what was that? Um, I'm not sure, but I think we're safe now. You don't think it was the monsters, do you? Nah. Can't be too far from Hunt Sunhaven now, can we? We should be arriving soon. I miss and think people have a hard time remembering you. Yeah. No, I get that. Sometimes you just, you get so used to a certain username. Now arriving at Sunhaven, we seem to have encountered some strange dark fog. So be careful as you step off the train. Was that a giant chocobo? Excuse me? Oh, there's a dragon friend on top of the train. Was that was what was powering the train? <laughs> I have just noticed this. Dra dragon doctor. <laughs> I looked up the romance option. Oh, oh, do we have do we have some interesting options? My goodness, what happened? Um, our train was hit by a wave of darkness. We saw the cloud of darkness sweeping across the land. It finally stopped here at the train station. Trains won't be able to come and go from Sunhaven like this. But that can wait. Are either of you hurt? It's quite frightening, but no one was hurt. What is that darkness? It's Kingdom Hearts' true essence. I'm sorry, I'll stop. Uh, that's a good question. Lucia, is he a romance object? <laughs> Asking for me. Um, it's a good question. Lucia, what should we do about the train station? Did 
the darkness, whatever it is, looks like it isn't going anywhere or causing any harm. Let's keep an eye on it for the moment until I can learn more about it. He's doing this so molder. <laughs> like he is. Perfect. Might have found my man already. We'll see though. Oh, my apologies. You both seem to have arrived under an unusual circumstance. I'm Lucia, Archmage and leader of, the S leader of Sunhaven. This is Nathaniel, captain of our city guard. It must be our new apprentice blacksmith, Lynn, and that would make you, Crystal, our new farmer. Yes, give me my chicken. As leader of Sunhaven, I like to meet our citizens, our new citizens personally. Welcome to Sunhaven. It's good to meet you both. Take my- <laughs> I want to like sound like I'm pouting while reading his dialogue. Uh, take my word that you have nothing to fear in Sunhaven. It is our sworn duty to keep the people of Sunhaven safe, no matter what. Don't worry, I will face this darkness. Frederick, my sword! Um, Nathaniel? Uh, <laughs> Nathaniel, please! <laughs> Carry your own damn sword. Thank you, Frederick. I don't think a sword will work. We'll need some time to research and come up with a solution. Hmm, you might be right. A sword probably isn't the best thing to fight dark magic clouds with. I'll post some guards to keep watch of the area in the meantime. <laughs> I think I might get this game. Definitely check it out. This seems really fun so far and I haven't even gotten into into gameplay, but I've seen it's been pretty um uh, a pretty popular category for streaming on Twitch, so I think it's it's probably a good one. <laughs> Silver Mom. Alright, Frederick, false alarm, you're dismissed. Uh, <laughs> now I gotta carry this sword away. He's a great kid. After his apprenticeship ends, he'll make a fine guard. All in good time. Speaking of a good time, maybe it's a good time to show our new citizens to their homes. Rob soldier, Jesus. <laughs> I think you're right, Captain. After what they've been through, I think a rest is in order. Come with me, Crystal. Your farm is waiting. And I'll show you to your new home, Lynn. Gosh darn it, Lynn. You're the lucky one. Uh, it's right near the quarry. I can't wait to see the work you and Solon do. And it was nice meeting you, too. Thanks for chatting with me on the train. Maybe we'll be able to talk again soon. Oh, and could I ask you not to mention the darkness to your fellow villagers? I just don't want everyone else to worry is all. We've got it under control. Uh, lead the way. I want to pet the giant chicken. I'm looking at the romance options and I'm modding this game so I can marry most of them at once. Oh, you guys are making me want to look at them. <laughs> I'm going to be good and I'm going to wait a bit, but maybe when we're done looking at the game today. Welcome to Sunhaven. Despite how adventurous your arrival here was, I'm sure we'll have it all figured out soon. Well, here we are. First things first, though, you need to decide where your house is going to go. Go ahead and pick a spot. Just so you know, the path we're standing on leads directly into Sunhaven. You can place your house close to the bridge if you'd like to be close to town. I can see some pretty nice spots around here. It's all up to you to decide. Good luck and farewell for now. I also want to look at them. <laughs> oh, bear with me, friends. Oh, wow. We already have our chicken. Oh, I need to stretch out my shoulder. Oh, I really wish why, or I wish I knew why it sometimes does this. Legit, I've been sitting in this chair for like five, six years now. On most days, no issue. Every now and then, big issue. I sit the same. I'm, you know, I'm not sitting anywhere I shouldn't be. Oh, I'm walking with, okay. Oh, I see, I see, okay. I'm gonna put it up here. That is, okay. Oh, oh. How do I? Oh, okay. Are you sure you want to place your house here? You'll need a demolition kit from the town hall if you want to move it later. If you move it after it's placed, your house will lose all contents and upgrades. Oh, okay. You're making me nervous. Just carrying the house with your elven mind powers. <laughs> uh, knock knock, look at you! Uh, up and at him already. You're really committed to this farming gig, huh? That's great. Who are you and why are you in my house? <laughs> Get out of my swamp. Where have my manners gone? My name is Anne, and I happen to be Sunhaven's most distinguished merchant. I wanted to officially welcome our new farmer to town. 
Speaking of which, I can't help but notice you don't seem to have any farm tools or seeds. I have a chicken. Why don't you let me take care of you? Man, Paul, I need to hydrate after that one, dear lord. <laughs> Seriously, what are you doing in my house? <laughs> I think I want to marry eight of them. This entire game is just thirst. Oh, yeah, officially, I've decided. Tag chicken. <laughs> Take care of me. I want to make a deal with you. I call it Anne's Ready to Go Farm Kit. All the tools you'll need. Lost 15 wheat seeds only for uh, 250 coins. What do you say? 150. Final offer. No, I'm going to be nice. Great. It's a deal. There's no relationship stronger than one born in business. You know, the pleasure is mine. Why don't we step outside and you can show me how you do your work? Uh, Okay. I got a scythe, a rusty hoe, rusty watering can, rusty axe, rusty pickaxe, wheat seeds, and co oh, I didn't get coins. I lost coins. Uh, ooh. Bear with my hair. Uh. <laughs> Invincible. <laughs> I love that. And it works, but she got kind of mad. Oh, really? I was hoping I would be able to change... It's telling me keybinds for computer. Um, rusty ho, that's me. <laughs> um, and I'm using controller, obviously, so maybe that's just not in yet. Oh no, it has it! Why don't you recognize my controller? Recognize the awesomeness that is my controller, please. I wish I like farming sims, these romance options. This is uh, to acquaintance or ahead with acquaintance with everybody. So you get flirty answers. Uh, your scythe takes care of weeds in a single slash. Press left click. Okay, whatever that is. It's not A, I'll tell you that much. B, X, it's X. These tickets aren't worth anything here, but they might be valuable elsewhere. I just got a ticket out of the grass. Okay. Is she just gonna sit there and watch me work? <laughs> I mean, I guess she did say that. Uh, plant wheat seeds. All right. I just got a spring token. Two, three. Oh. Oh god. Okay. Wait. Wait. Put, oh, jeez. Four. rock is in my way. Excuse me, I cannot... Okay, we'll go the other way then, fine. Um... Seeds? Plant wheat seeds. One, two... Three... Four, five, okay. Can I get rid of this stone? Okay, so I planted 10 wheat seeds and now I need to water them. I can do this. Oh, this is one of those games where they'll like grow a little bit right away after you water them. Brand new typing. Brand new typing. Yeah, this is Itsu's question. Watering can is empty. Left click. Okay, so X. To refill it. Uh, and then it just says log. I don't know what you want me to do with the log. I'm assuming you want me to chop. So, is that like a level down there? Am I seeing that right? Yeah, okay, that's an experience. Okay. I like, I like experience bars. I have a mod for that in Stardew. Oh, I need one more log, heck. I guess when I planted them. Yeah, if you didn't play for a few days, I know. All right, turn to you on the bridge. 
Oh. Bonus reward. Choose one. <gasps> Fishing experience? Combat experience? Mining or farming? Oh, that's so strange that you get experience as a bonus. Um, put it into farming. Nice job, farmer. Not bad for such a small job. If you really want to build up your farm, you should take those logs to a crafting bench. Hey, I can see one from here, actually. Combat. It's got to 10 characters you want to marry. Uh-oh. Crafting bench, you can turn logs into planks and other useful things. Anyways, I have other business to tend to. You should check out the town general store. You can buy more seeds there because, let's be real, a measly 15 wheat isn't going to get you very far. Uh, it's directly to the right of your farm. You can't really miss it, especially if you check your map. Anyways, it's nice to meet you. Uh, what was your name? I'm Crystal. Oh yeah, cute name. Listen, Crystal, if you want to make some real money, try growing more, like 40 wheat. Once you harvest it, sell it in the cell portal next to us. That's a cell portal, okay. Only on Steam right now? As far as I'm aware, yeah. As far as I'm aware. I don't know if there's plans to bring it elsewhere, but... Uh, you'll make some nice profit for a change. But it's up to you. Live your life here in Sunhaven however you want. Just make sure it pays. It is very straight to the point, yeah. Okay. Oh, we even have sell price. I like that. You have an unspent skill point. Press none to open the skill tree. <laughs> Where's the none button, chat? Exploration. So we have exploration, farming, mining, combat, and fishing. Oh, we love a good skill tree. Air skip. Jump again while in midair, quickly dash forward. Sharp axe. Increased damage done to trees. Double take. Collecting a forageable grants a 20, 30, 40% chance to gain an extra item. I guess as you level it up. And good neighbor. Each builds and board quest completed towards half an additional community tokens. <laughs> Is he not? Ah, yes, the nun button. Okay, so I want the double take. Take a look at our other menus here. Oh, we can actually see people. Wait a minute. Is it just people I've... Oh, it's just people I've met, I think. So, we have normal hearts, and then it's like we have locked hearts. You can see if you've given gifts to people. Apparently, Anne already likes us just a smidge. Okay. Um... To the left of the any key. <laughs> Use your map to find the general store and then I have to harvest wheat. I guess we'll come back for that. Is there like a run? Must have one mailbox on fire. Oh, I think I tried to pick that up by accident. Oh. Oh, we good, we good. Hello? Hi, who are you? My name's Crystal. I'm the new farmer. You have a new farmer? Nobody told me. Hi, stranger. Are you a farmer? Magic red lady visited yesterday instead of farmer was coming. My name is Crystal. <laughs> no, it's not. I'm Pod. Hi, I'm sorry. Did I do something? The new neighbor, I'm happy to make your acquaintance. I'm Pod's mother, Kara. Crystal, that's a nice name. I'm glad the old farm has someone to care for it now. I'm guessing people without portraits probably aren't, like, romanceable, is my guess. Also, uh, take a look at our map while we're here. Oh, oh, the controls are a little wonky, but it's okay. It's okay. Also, the music is just a smidge loud, I think. Hey, Mimna, I'm good. How are you doing? Welcome on in. Okay. 
Catherine. Is your name Crystal? So good to meet you. I'm Catherine. I own the farming store here. That's right. Wait, how did you know my name? Don't you know? I'm surprised you can't tell. I'm a witch. It isn't hard to divine the name of our new farmer. Okay. We met Lucia earlier. Hello, Crystal. Despite the looming darkness, I've had a good feeling ever since you've moved in. This is though Sunhaven is embers, but a sudden wind is rekindling the flame. Uh, what's it like being in charge of Sunhaven? It certainly comes with challenges. At first, few people accepted me as leader because I'm so young. I have to earn everyone's support gradually. Oh no, Memna. I hope you feel better soon. Never in town looks to me when there's a decision to make. I can't believe anyone doubted you. Well, you did not see my first year as leader. I made my share of mistakes then. Suffice to say, it was incredibly lucky to have Elios guiding me along my path becoming Archmage. Uh, we're in an uphill battle to revise Sunhaven's economy. It's crucial we bring more travelers and new shops into town now more than ever. Enjoy your food. Still, I'm not worried. Sunhaven has a bright future and there will be... I will be there fanning the flames. Will you help me? Do whatever I can. All right. Wise old man. You don't even have a name. You know what I've learned, kid? The early bird catches a lemon and makes it into lemonade or something like that. Oh. I got a berry. Hi. Okay, that's just a guard. Don't need a name. Oh, hi. See you again. Sorry, I don't need a name when your claim to fame is beating the ducks. You just become the duck guy. Uh, sorry you've been about the rough landing you had here on Sunhaven. You got any crops growing yet? Yes, indeed. I'm Captain of the Guard. The Sunhaven Corps I include some of the finest soldiers I've seen. In truth, I'm honored to lead them. You won't find soldiers with more spirit than those under my command. He has such a sassy looking face when he's happy. Uh, even if it isn't usually a lot of fighting to do here, they manage to keep their chins up. With everything that's happened, is Sunhaven in any danger? At the moment? No, not at all. The Great Army has established a military outpost in Sunhaven for times like this. We're here to keep an eye on things and ensure the town's borders remain secure. Okay. This must be at Sunhaven's general store. Better head inside and see what they've got. <laughs> Make life take the lemons back. Take this evil around. <laughs> Making cakes. Oh no. Stab them with your juicer. <laughs> they have different outfits in different times of year? Really? Gotta be that new neighbor people are talking about. Welcome to the general store. Oh, wait one sec. There we go. Anyway, I'm Emmett. I work here and over at the farming shop and down at the fishing store and in town hall. Okay, I work a lot. I heard people say you're supposed to be a farmer. Well, we sell lots of basic seeds among loads of other things. Our furniture stock also changes every day. Okay, Tom Nook. Uh, be sure to always stop in. Wait, how do you work so many places at once? I keep my nose to my work. No distractions, but... And I move really quick. Do you ever not work? That's the great thing about this place. There's never not any work to do. See, they set this bulletin board right outside the shop. Everyone goes there to post up job offerings. All those odd jobs net me a pretty good, pretty gold coin or two, that's for sure. You don't waste time with stuff like sleeping. You have all sorts of time to get stuff done. You went onto the wiki. Ah, uh, actually meant me to finish a delivery that was supposed to be up on the board. Is though, I don't think I'll be able to finish it in time due to being stuck at work. I'll do it. Uh, an order to Soldan or Smith. I was supposed to deliver it to him, but I guess I got caught up with work. Just take the order to him so you can smith up what our barracks need. And remember that people can't wait forever. You usually only get a few days to complete a task once you accept it. Oh, Matilda, I'm going to miss you guys too. It's going to be kind of a weird week for me, but it'll be good. I promise we'll come back and we're gonna jump into Final Fantasy and I'll probably end up crying and getting very emotional over it. <laughs> cool. Okay, so this is our 
store. So I'm trying to find if there's a run button and I'm not seeing anything. Mom said springtime job would be fun, but all I do is sweep the floors and stock shelves. This isn't fun at all. Oh, are you doing all right? I hope everything's okay now that you're back at home. Um... Okay, I have no idea who Solon is and where the blacksmith is, but we're just gonna take a look around and see. I like the, um... I like the pixel art in this game. I like the... the look of it here. Dragon. <laughs> you're very Sebastian-esque, but you're blonde. It's been a new farmer. I'm Claude. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to try to give you something. Uh, I will see you later. I just want to look for the blacksmith right now and talk to people. Competing merchant. You look very shifty, my friend. Oh, wow. <laughs> These are so cute. Hi, I'm Kitty. You're new to the farm. Or you're that new farmer in town, aren't you? So happy to meet you. It's hard to tell who's... Like... I don't want to say an actual NPC, but someone with, um... With a, with a dialogue. Portrait. Actually, wait a minute. Can I? Okay, I'm gonna use my mouse for this because it doesn't want to click on. Uh, what's a romance stall? Solon Smithery is down. Okay, I was going the wrong way. I got you. I hope that you, <laughs> I'll tell you when you're older. I hope that you take some time for yourself and just relax. I got stuck on a mushroom. There must be a run button somewhere. This is very slow pace. Okay, it's just a merchant. There is a really fancy looking chest here. I need a key for it. Someone's ex-apprentice. Used to be Solon's apprentice, but he said my copper helmets always come out dented. If I ain't good enough, then no one is. Run button is any. <laughs> Air skip speed boost thing eventually. Yeah, I saw that earlier. I didn't think it was actually going to be like a handy. <laughs> now I know though. Well, I bet you're that flirtatious new farmer Lynn was going on about. I've, I've, I've been flirting? Not wasting any time with any apprentice who isn't serious, and this one is already better than the last. Better not be a distraction, you hear what I'm saying, farmer? God, it's that pesky little dragon again. Let me look out! Oh. It's a little baby dragon friend. Oh, Taylor Takeover, thank you. Turn lizard cause a rock slide. You alright over there? I'm alright. Alright, let's get these rocks cleared out. Help me, will you? Just the one? I'm not seeing... Maybe I'm missing it, but I'm not seeing a stamina meter. I can see health and mana, but it seems like I could just, you know, get rid of rocks all day. I enjoy Tater, too. He's a cutie. Probably one of the favorite things I've 
had done for the stream. Oh no, affection! You can't, you can't go yet. Not allowed. Is that random? <laughs> Maybe. All right, that'll do it. Thanks for the help. Maybe I was a little quick to judge a farmer. What was that baby dragon doing anyway? It's been roosting up in the warm quarry rocks. I figure it must like the heat. I let him stay, but the little bugger doesn't seem to know its own strength. A simple flap of its wings can send rubble flying. For my part, these two copper helmets from the barracks order won't hammer themselves. For you, I'd reckon that talking to Archmage Lucia is your work order. I got a part to play here and mine ain't lugging these old bones back to town while the forge is hot. Town hall, got it. All right, um, let's get mining this time. Cool. All right, we'll see you later, Blue. I hope you have a good one and I'll see you next week. Faye, hello, how are you doing? Welcome on in. If you guys are just joining us, we're doing a Simply Try Day, which means we've been trying out various games, whether they're full, early access, or demos. Uh, we're currently checking out Sunhaven, which is this very cute, uh, so far very in-depth little farming, farming sim. Oh, I spoke to you earlier. I remember you. I'm doing pretty good today. I'm just incredibly excited for tomorrow. Oh, the farmer. That's right. Lucia told us there was someone moving in there. It's good to meet you. My name is Judith. Yes, yeah, so long as the borders of Sunhaven are secure, we can continue to keep watch over the train station. The path to the northern forest, forest should remain close to citizens for their own safety. The northern forest must be quite dangerous right now, Captain. Are you sure your soldiers are safe? Of course, we've got all under control. Sunhaven has all the time it needs to figure out its next step. It's Crystal, what brought you to Town Hall? I was looking for you. Ah, uh, Beetle, I'm actually going to be going out tomorrow to pick it up at 9 a.m. from my local GameStop. I didn't get it digitally, I got it physically. Mike, however, has the option to play it right away from uh, midnight tonight, and I'm a little jealous. We'll see if he actually does or not. <laughs> oh, really, it's you? Is that so? I was just wrapping up a little meeting with Bernard and Nathaniel, so I believe I'm free to help. Just a moment. Let's meet again on this issue later, shall we? Was it that you needed? A baby dragon is causing trouble in the quarry. Oh dear, is that little dragon still causing rock slides? We were hoping Solon, as gruff as he is, would be able to frighten it away, though for some reason it keeps coming back. Hmm. I think we should try luring the dragon to the ground, where it can be captured and relocated, but we'll need to use some kind of bait. Couldn't help but over here! Do you say we're having trouble with a little baby dragon? Not at all. I came here to renew my business license for the pet shop, but I don't need to renew my license until next month. But that's okay, because now I think I can help you with your problem. Oh my god. Really, Kitty? That's wonderful to hear. Crystal, meet Kitty. She sells barn animals here in Sunhaven. Town Hall sells permits for barns, but you'll have to stop at Kitty's shop for animals. Yep, Mike's on his way over. Um, I don't know if he's already up or out. <laughs> But he's on his way over at some point today. Nice to meet you. Anyways, on the subject of your baby dragon, I don't know much about baby dragons, but I do know that they love to eat fish. If Kitty was a baby dragon, Kitty would nest at the quarry because it's so close to the ocean. But if you had a good juicy fish, you could get... It. Okay, can I go fishing now? Let's say that you'll need an extra, extra juicy fish to attract the baby dragon just to be safe. This plan is a bit spur of the moment, but it just might work. I believe Peter, our local fisherman, uh, could probably help you out with catching an appren appropriate fish. Apprentice fish. Uh, you can probably find him at the southern docks right now. 
You get me a proper fish and I'll take care of the rest. I have Blobby actually, and it's why I'm not really too fussed about not being able to play it right away. Um, I went out and got Sun and Moon and Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, both of those at midnight releases. And we kind of got home, played for about 30 minutes, and then both of us were just exhausted, so we went to sleep. <laughs> so. Um, let's get combat. Yeah, it depends on how tired he is. If, like, I, I've already told him that we're going pretty early in the morning. Like, I want to be there right as it opens sort of deal. Um, yes, combat. <laughs> um, so he might just go to sleep early with me, but he might also stay up. And if he stays up, that's when it gets dangerous. <laughs> Oh, hello. Hey neighbor, I'm Dr. Bornhart. Uh, you look pretty healthy to me, but come see me if you're feeling under the weather. Call me Warnhart if you don't want to call me a doctor, but really I don't mind either way. You are definitely still broken, unfortunately. It's, I have no idea why it's not working right. Two masks, two pairs of gloves, yeah. But you're, you have to have it sort of deal, I get it. Oh wow, this is fancy. Oh, right there, you look like you need something from me. Well, what is it? Maybe help catching a special fish. Yeah, what kind of special fish are we talking about? Briefly account the situation to Peter, who listens with a quiet smirk, nodding along as you talk. Oh yeah, so why don't you go on and catch this fish yourself? I don't have a fishing rod. You don't have a fishing rod? Heck, take my old one! Fishing is real easy! Just use your rod like any other tool. When you spy the shapes of fish in the water, cast your rod out. Fish are coy, so wait until you feel a strong bite, then give your rod a pull and set the hook. It's up to you to land the fish. Seems like we don't have time to waste. Let me handle this one. Just stand back and take it easy, alright? Yeah, <laughs> silver pond. Uh, Peter? Watch closely as I demonstrate an ancient fisherman's art to you. Putting a worm on the hook. Fascinating. Alright, the hook's all loaded up. I'll have your fish in a jiffy, don't you worry. Oh! This guy again! I wasn't fishing for you! Get off of my line! Sorry, Crystal, this may be a little bit too big and juicy for a single baby dragon. Put it back, put it back! <laughs> all right, all right, hold your horse, fish. <laughs> put it back where it came from, or so help me. Let's try that again. Here we go, these chunky groupers are nice and fatty, not too agreeable to most people's tastes. But I bet your baby dragon couldn't resist it if it tried. It's really funny. Now I gotta make the slow, slow walk back up. <laughs> I think so far, it's it's a very minor minor gripe because I know we can obviously get better movement and stuff, but it's my only issue is just how slow you move. I'm back, apparently. Hi. Okay, let's see. Hopefully she's still in the same place. She might not be though, it's like 9.30 at night. <laughs> it is closed for the evening. Okay, so we might have to... Wait, um... I'm not sure. Let's 
go ahead and go back to our farm, I guess, and then maybe tomorrow morning. If you aren't in bed by 12 a.m., you'll fall asleep where you stand to be charged a hospital fee. Make sure you don't miss your bedtime. Oh my god, this is... Okay. I'm running as fast as I can. Granny shuffling my way home. That pause in music when you enter makes me nervous. I feel like it's crashing, but so far it hasn't. Okay, so I got... Why did I get so much experience there? Holy crap. Is that normal? Okay. What is interact? Oh, that's interact. Okay. Your game saves automatically, so you don't need to worry about saving your progress. That's good to know. Oh. Should I water it again? Put down this chicken. Achievement unlocked. There's a cl clock here. <laughs> Can I oh, rename? Rename. What are we naming the chicken chat? Chicken names. I don't know if there's some specific clonk. Doggy. I do like food based names. Rosemary, the technically food based names. Daisy? I. I'm gonna go with Nuggy. I'll go with Nuggy for now. This is Nuggy. I can I can pet Nuggy. Nuggy just pooped an egg out at me. Thank you, Nuggy. I oh, probably shouldn't sell that. I'm gonna need it. Uh. Oh god. Is there no way to- Oh! I want to instantly transfer stuff. Oh, I have to bring it over manually. Oh no. There we go. I apparently got a letter. To Farmer Crystal, I'm Bernard, an administrator at Sunhaven's Town Hall. I wanted to reach out with this housewarming gift as a representative of Sunhaven. I hope it gets you get settled on your new land. Um, I can sell you a barn for livestock, as well as house upgrades. Um, upgrade table to upgrade the buildings. Okay. This items. So we got wood fences. This man knows the way to my heart. I like fences and torches. Goose. That'd be cute. Um. Speak to Rosa at the Bracks. Harvest 40 wheat. I want to see where Kitty is here. So, oh. <laughs> Don't do that. There we go. I feel like so far with this game, it's gorgeous. I like the music, I like the visuals a lot. I like the idea of it. Um, and even though it has keybinds for controller in the main menu, it doesn't actually use them in gameplay here. Um, or at least not often. It does on doors and stuff, but not on other stuff for some reason. Um, here, 
Can I? There we go. Okay, I can't do that with controller yet. Uh, that's where I need to go. So I am here. Uh, okay. Hopefully we're going the right way. Yeah. That needs to be a little updated, but it's okay. Oh, hi. What is with everyone? Okay, we're going to look at the bachelors and bachelorettes after this. Oh, it's you. Um, the new farmer. Sorry you caught me with my head in my clouds. I'm Jin. I know, it's fine. It's, it's, my head is all. It's really nice meeting you. Oh, boy. Yeah, it looks... <laughs> Jin looks cute. Um, it looks like there's just a lot of... A lot of character to this game, and I really like the look of it so far. It's just... A little bit more tweaking, but that's okay. Oh, these are so cute. Okay. Hi. I brought fish. Do I smell a big tasty fish in your pack? Hand it here and I'll make it into some yummy baby dragon food. Just visit me tomorrow, okay? Sounds good. Liam. Must be the one who brought the old farm. I'm Liam. It's good to meet you. Boys, my name's Liam. Wait, I already said that. Mood. Some of the pixel art. I'm getting vibes from a whole lot of different games. I see a little bit of Stardew, but like very minimal. Um, but I also see a little bit of a game called Eastward that I was playing not too long ago. Uh, not on stream, just on my own. And, um, Kinseed as well, which is another farming sim that I really want to get into properly. All right. What else can I do here? Okay, so if I go up here... Is that a Mareep in the pen? <laughs> Oh, there's the giant chicken! Armor, do you have a minute? I'm Rose, at secondary command of the Sunhaven Corps. Sunhaven is safe, but monsters live just outside of town. It's my job to make sure you're prepared for that. Here, take the sword and step up to the dummy. Give it five good whacks so I can see your technique. Oh, uh, I'm assuming I should probably have this on my hotbar. Didn't I sell the eggs earlier? Hey, not bad. It's not all about strength, though. Speed and agility can be just as important. Try landing three jump attacks for me. Okay. Two. Three. There we go. You're natural with that thing, but I wonder how good are you at distance? Try shooting the dummy five times with this crossbow. Oh, you keep giving me items. Uh, okay. Here we go. I think sound is like my go-to first thought as well, I have to admit. Beautiful work, farmer. It's good to know that some of our citizens can handle themselves in the scrap. Go ahead and keep one of those weapons, but only one. Ooh, um... Need a sword. Hello, citizen. Come to learn about combat. Good! Knowing how to defend yourself is always helpful. First, we'll cover their basics. Um... Uh, okay... Range and magic have their uses, of course, but swords are truly the greatest weapon. Rosa launches into a long, long speech about the superior, supposed superiority of swords, going into intense detail about the history of swords and their modern-day uses. You feel yourself nodding off a bit when Rosa stops and scolds you. All right, citizen, snap out of it. If you don't want to learn everything there is to know about swords, then suit yourself. This is co this combat skill tome can fill you in on the rest. Mistletone imbued with every 
or the very essence of combat. Reading its pages will impart increased combat prowess and experience. Combat skill point. Okay. Who are you? Walking with papers. Oh, you're just a clerk. <laughs> Got you. Plasma. That would be neat. Okay, we met you earlier. I want to go meet all the cuties. Like, legit, that is my goal. Also, I, I should probably try fishing at some point, too. Okay, so that's like a selling place. There's Anne, Rex. Uh, we met Liam earlier. How many of you met so far? Like a handful, like four maybe? I don't know. I might try to enjoy your food. I'm gonna go this way. I haven't been over here yet. May as well look around, right? Oh, hello? Duke? This is what Anne keeps as a pet fiend. This big guy must cost a fortune. I love him. We respect Duke in this household chat. There's horses in that... cafe. There's a frog on top of that roof, too. Oh, hello. You're not sketchy at all. Hooded Traveler. Just passing through this town is all. You don't bother me and I won't bother you. Hmm. There was another locked chest. They remind me of the ones in Fable, actually. Yeah, lots of cuties, definitely. Are you that fishing guy? Oh, I can't even interact with you. Um, no, this is actually the area I want to go to. I think I'll get to this game once he's settled. Yeah, like I definitely plan to come back to this one. Oh my goodness me. It's a snackoon. How can I get to move out of the way? Maybe if I bring it something it likes. I'm gonna assume carrots, but... How do I fish? That's weird. Maybe only certain places or maybe where there's shadows? I'm just pretending to be a bunny. Is that another one? Just a big Totoro looking friend. I'm gonna get to move out of the way. Maybe if I bring it something it likes. Do you like apples? By any chance? Let's see. Oh, sorry. Oh, I ate it. Whoopsie, sorry. Okay. Oh, I see on the- okay, I'm- I just have the observant skills of a teaspoon. Apples, okay. It wants ten apples, ten bananas. Got you. Understood. Can do. I will take this for me then. Please do not perceive me. Yeah, I want to play some Coral Island at some point here, definitely. There's just- there's so many good games, that's the problem. Oh, oh, okay. Don't, don't do that. Don't fall in. Or ignore that thought and up sending her a link to an article about the subject on Facebook and blocked her right after sending it. I don't think I want anything to do with her anymore. Oh, Rebecca, I'm so sorry. That's so frustrating when, you know, it's your family. These things are called pep inches. How did 
that hit me? I was- you were nowhere near me. I know, I know, it's the same thing here. Especially when I remember Wonderful Life remake, Final Fantasy 16, like, it's just there's too much good stuff. I don't know where I'll have time for it all. Fishy? Oh, those things respond. Oh god, they're coming this way, okay. Oh, jeez. Out of curiosity, though, for anyone in here who's played this, have you guys checked out the multiplayer? Because I saw that was an option on the main menu, and I'm very intrigued. I think Mike would probably be interested, too. I think it's the first time in years I've had so many games out within a year. Yeah, it's like... It's far too many, but it's, it's good. I'm not complaining. <laughs> but at the same time, yeah. I don't know when I'll have the time nor the money for everything. Well, it's you again. It's good to see a face I actually recognize, especially after what happened on the train. What do you do here, Lynn? I'm a blacksmith, or I guess apprentice blacksmith. Solon is teaching me, but I've only just started training with him. I hope to be as good as him one day. I don't seem surprised when they hear that, but I don't see why. Many women in my old village work the forge. Is that really so odd? Where did- oh, where do you say you're from? From a little village in the east, so I'm still learning to live in a big city like this. It's a lot to take in. Uh, I'm adjusting to. I have to do boss battles separately. I guess they don't want it to be too... Like, too easy, maybe? Still interested, though. That cut off. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. I think mouse and keyboard is a lot easier for for this. Oak tree. Wonderful seasonal rewards, wheat seeds. I don't really know what anything is really for yet, so. Alrighty. That is how you jump. I just jumped at my door. That's always good. Yeah, so that's a lot less experience accumulated. I, I still am not quite sure why we got so much. I don't know if it's just they just don't want you to start level one, maybe? Because I was already like level five or six, I think. Actually, you know what? Let me take a look, see here. Oh, so I do have a combat skill point. Fireball, agility, heavy hitter, extra pleading. Some agility. I do like that this game has like a nice big skill tree though. Um, really quickly here, I wanted to look up the bachelors and bachelorettes for this game so bear with me for just a second here um sun even wiki i'll bring it up on screen as well um just bear with me for a moment oh 
Perfect. That's the right one. Eh, it doesn't quite fit, but that's okay. Um, so let's take a little look see here, shall we? And again, obviously, spoilers for people who want to experience the game on your own and not look at the wiki. I respect that. Okay, romance candidates. Let's take a look here, shall we? So we have Anne, who we've met, Catherine, Lynn, Iris, Kitty, Lucia, and Zyla, maybe? Uh, and then we have Cloud, Darius, Donovan, Jun, Liam, Nathaniel, Van, and Warnhart. There's some cuties. I think so far, Jun and Nathaniel are sticking out to me. Liam's also a cutie. Uh, Lynn is a cutie. I it's a lot of cuties. This isn't fair. <laughs> this game is too cute. Pokemon movies we watch Amazing World of Gumball. Haven't seen it in years or the recent series. Finish a series I've been watching on and off or rewatch a 2000 or 200 episode. Oh my goodness. Jeez, Brandon, that is quite a lot. Um, yeah, there's some good options. I'm I'm here for it. I, I like the, the artwork in this game quite a lot. I like the artwork quite a lot. <laughs> Silver Palm's just like all of them. If you're willing. Oh, I'm sorry. I missed it. I missed it. Wait, wait, wait. No, I want I do want to see that. Wait. I didn't even think we have outfits. Uh... Oh, okay, I'm seeing some of them there, I think. Anne, Catherine, Donovan, Jun, Kitty, Lucia, Lynn, Van, Warnhart. Oh, here we go, here we go. Summer and Autumn. Okay. I like that they have the different outfits. That's very cool. Neat. You can date everyone with every precautions. Oh, perfect. Toy effect. Yeah, I just I just was thinking where's winter Europe? Absolutely right. So default, summer, autumn, winter, that's so cute. That's so heckin' cute. I love that, that's adorable. This isn't fair. I kind of wish the other residents also had pictures. I don't know if that's like planning to be or like in planning to be added. <laughs> Bisexual panic, it's a mood. <laughs> Darius and Nathaniel are the only ones for you. He's only unfortunately changes very, very little. I like the hat. That's very like Sora from Christmas Town vibe. Very cute. Oh, <laughs> Iris, you were also so cute. But like, <laughs> I'm sorry if we called you out of lurk with that. Nathaniel is the only one. Darius is on your list as well. Like how we this is just thirst. This is just entirely thirst. Maybe potentially cloud. Oh, Liam. Oh, that's so cute. That's adorable. I like this. I like this a lot. Um, that being said though, friends, I think that might be where I'm actually going to be wrapping up for now at least.